Hello everybody, this is Miles Luigi welcoming you back to Let's Play Extra Mario Brothers. So, last time we were just literally one pipe away from being able to go into lower North Fair, lower Fire Fair, whatever you want to call it, and it's like a mash of pipes all together that all just leads down to this area super awesome different music. It's different than our regular castle. Oh god, I, I watch out for the fire bars at the very beginning here. Oh, small Mario difficult path. This is a space jump. <laughs> Ironically, the fire bar just saved my life there. I didn't even think about that, but that that's literally a forest becomes small moment. Oh boy. Nope, 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 no. Oh, well, I, I didn't last very long in this castle. This castle is a little bit different, I gotta say, just looking at it naturally. Regular castles... I guess are different. This one appears it's going to be a little bit more of a maze? That's what I'm seeing so far, and I've died again. The music... Ugh, oh, I recognize the music. It's definitely something like it sounds like regular Mario Brothers, actually. It's a Mario Brothers remix. Oh, what is it? I gotta listen to it some more. I definitely recognize it, though. Give me some time and I'll identify it. I know I will. Provided I can quit dying to the first set of Goombas in room one out of who knows how many rooms. Oh, that is... It's a good thing I racked up on one-ups, but holy cow. Oh, my... <laughs> you see, that is a perfect example how in the Super Mario Bros. engine, it only counts when you're jumping downwards on an enemy. Since I was jumping upwards, you know, I died. Ah, there, there, there. Holy cow, we're back in room two again. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Stupid potable. Getting in my way. The fire bar. The everything. The everything! The everything is in my way! <laughs> okay. Ooh. I guessed right there. Okay. Ooh. I think there's something to the right here. <laughs> I'll take it! I'll take it! I'll take it! Down path, up path, okay, yeah. So this is literally nor lore nor fair. There's no question about it. This is a completely different area, completely separate from everything else, and we're probably going to find some cool things here, or at the very least going to find a key. Okay, my finger's on this theme. I think, I think this is Super Mario Sunshine whenever you're battling baby Bowser. And yes, I uh, Shadow Mario, I should say. Damn it, I just spoiled the... <laughs> Plot to Super Mario Sunshine, in case you haven't played it since it came out in, what, 2001? <laughs> Woo! I like this room. I like this room a lot. I like this room a lot. Oh my gosh! Yes! 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 <laughs> Mario doesn't spin. Mario should spin. Okay, such a minor detail, but anyway. The screw attack! If this works like I think it's gonna work, when I jump upwards, I kill enemies. Um, it still doesn't protect me from holes, but... That would be really useful, because you jump up, you kill enemies, you fall down, you still kill enemies. Now, these guys are a different story, because if I land on them, I'm dead meat, and ooh. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking, I just went, oh, shh. Oh. I guess the screw attack actually has some practical purpose behind destroying everything! You can go through bricks with it, how about that? Me likey the screw attack very much, although this is ironic. My upward jump now is more powerful than my lower jump if I'm seeing this correctly. Whoa! I need to come back here with uh, Fire Mario. Oh yeah, I might have to save state blitz to make it back here with the Fire Mario, whoa! But uh, I'm kind of curious now, let me save state. Okay, the screw attack can go through spikes. How about that? The, when you lose the screw attack, when you go downward, you can't go through spikes anymore. I guess that's the way of life. But anyway, uh, Poto Bow. This is a terrible situation, all things considered. It's like everything's low on the ground. Actually, for science, I also want to. Oh, the fire bar. Go on. Can I screw attack through things that would normally kill me? I saw I can screw attack through spikes, so. Fire bar. It's kind of hard to test. I totally was going in the wrong direction. Ugh. Screw attack would be horribly, horribly, horribly broken if it worked like it did in regular Metroid where it goes the entire way through and allows you to jump through everything. Okay, there's my test. Yes, you can screw attack through everything. Okay, I am going to really love this power-up. Haha! <laughs> Why did I wait all the way till I had seven keys to get the screw attack? 
Someone answer me that, and why do I keep... I... It's part of my blood to just think, oh, I have screw attack. I can just kill everything. Wah! Wah! Die! I'm gonna jump into you! I'm gonna jump into you! But for Mario, he doesn't benefit like that. My down jump is now with a weakness. It used to be the only way I killed things. Now it's how I still die from things. This room's kicking my butt, by the way, so I'm just gonna jump cut till I get past it. That isn't too hard now, Miles Luigi. Now we're gonna take the down pipe here, which should take me into a room that just has a whole lot of pipes. <laughs> you cannot get through here with all the space jump. I wanna see someone actually try to do this with the space jump, if it's even possible. <sighs> One moment. This room is just filled with pipes you can't go in. Ooh, this will be tricky even with space jump. Nope, nope, nope. Can't bonk head on that pipe, without a doubt. I'm thinking I'm just gonna have to fall a little bit and do the jump of faith! <laughs> I even got the bounce off the enemy. <sighs> There! <laughs> That's a nasty jump to make, I gotta say. Ooh, ultra fire blocks to the left there. Probably just leads to a bonus. I don't like this potable. Uh, 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 oh, I should have made a save state in this room. Great! I get to make that jump again. Alright, let's go ahead and try this again. Fire potable in the way. Jump, jump! Whew! I mean, there there is the bar down there, but I don't trust that bar down there. Good luck getting through this room if the lights are turned off. Aha! I don't like this room at all. Now well, there's an upper way that we could have taken, and it looks like these paths are going to consolidate a little bit, or the other pipe goes somewhere completely different, huh? All right. Haha! Who needs your bottom platform when you can do that? All right, let's. Ooh! Screen scroll scrolls to the right. Do I go down to evil? That looks like a mouth. <laughs> uh, let's go to the right. It got me a mushroom. I'm just curious where this goes first, just because I saw. Ooh, the screen scrolled. It got me a fire flower. Oh, perpetually scrolling room. It's a good thing I double checked because I now have power ups going down further deep into lore, fire fair, nor fair, whatever the hell I decided to name this. That's the evilest save point in the entire game. Wow, I am literally going to use save states to hit a save point. <laughs> You're probably meant to- oh, can I not even duck jump anymore when I have the screw check? No, you can. Okay, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. I want to get this save point. I want to get this save point. <laughs> no, I want this save point. Don't ask me why. I just want to prove that it is indeed possible to actually get the save point. See? It is possible. There! I proved it's possible. Then returning, just space jump back. <laughs> Oh, hell and a half for just a save point, yeah. That that honestly looks like one of those save points you you get to, and you're like, oh my gosh, the save point, and then you either have to be extremely careful, like I wasn't showing too much care there because of save states, and then pain and anguish as you die there and go back to wherever your last save point was, which I think my last save point was right after I got the screw attack, so that is one heck of a going back there. And Miles Luigi, you need to learn to jump. Yes, I do. I kind of like a fresh timer, because you know I am in a superheated room and I don't know how far or big or gigantic this entire uh, place spans, so yeah. No, 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 no. This is probably one of the evilest blargs in the entire game, because all his fireballs actually go at an angle instead of just up and down. Okay, the ambushing Koopa Troop is not gonna get me when I can screw attack right into his belly. Yes! No! No! Momentum! No! There's basically two speeds in Mario. There's regular speed and way too fast. Oh god, please don't ambush me. Oh, there's too many enemies on the screen, so he wasn't gonna toss a fireball. Okay. 
Alright, Blitz, please don't run into an enemy. Yeah! Yeah! Ooh, 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 ooh. I like this music. Aha! Our last, presumably last key. I'm assuming there isn't a ninth key, but it makes sense. We got four secret keys in each area, and now four keys in every single area's temple. Before we go over to area five, Area 3's castle had something that really intrigued me. That was the, uh, you know, the spike pits that had that one pipe. I want to know where that leads to. So, we're going to figure that out in this episode. One moment, guys. Okay, here we go. Now the question is, how do we even get fireballs down here? That is actually a huge hassle. Wow. Well, the key thing here is the pipe, so I could probably just afford a massive load of save states till I manage to successfully shoot you with the spikes on the pipe. Although Mario actually can't change direction in midair, which is a good thing to know, which means I probably need to jump to the other side. I can't stand that platform because, you know, fire bar. Alright, so we're gonna save state here. Fall! Try to. Ugh, I didn't even get the fireball out. Oh, the fireballs disappear. That's no good. How the hell do you even get this pipe? Ugh. This is probably when I finally get into it. This is the hacker pipe. Wow. Wowzers. Yeah, the fireballs just disappear. That's bollocks. I don't suppose my screw attack helps at all here at all either, does it? No, it doesn't. Wow. I have no clue how this was intended then. Because, yeah, I suppose I could craftily timed space jump might be able to get the fireballs out yeah now do I have the room here to go down the pipe no I don't <laughs> okay there we go that is pretty ridiculous if you ask me and not only that that's just a shortcut that's just a shortcut to the three castle. Can I, oop, can I, can I? Yes, yes I can, and I could have gone to that area, but okay. All right, well, we've learned a lot of the secrets of this area. Now the question is, do I kill myself, get a game over, or do I complete the three castle again? Uh, this is a really easy room to game over in if I can get to the save point. That's funny. Game over in this room so I can get back to world one. To do so, you have to get to the world's most evil save point in the entire game. There we go. There we go. Now let's game over. Woohoo! Now we're back in Area 1 with presumably all the power-ups, unless there's something in Area 5, like the triple jump or the power-up to run left. As I get to Area Area 5, just one comment I want to make. I like this hack, it's a bit difficult for my tastes. A lot of it would have been improved if you could run to the left, but... Uh, I guess you take what you can take with the Mario 1 engine. Could you reprogram Mario 1 to let you run to the left? I'm genuinely curious. This is actually a legitimate question I'm asking everyone out there in the audience. And most of you I know won't know the answer. But to the one out of, I guess, a hundred thousand of you that do know the answer, please let me know. Can you reprogram Super Mario Brothers to run to the left? If you can, get this ROM, reprogram it so you can run to the left, and see what happens, I guess. <laughs> Alright, if I remember correctly, Area 5 is up this way. Yes. Yes, it is. And so, the start of Area 5, which we will explore on the next episode of Let's Play Extra Mario Brothers! Will it be the final episode, or will Area 5 be like Chozodia and Metroid Zero Mission the game has only just begun? I actually don't know, but find out next time on Let's Play Extra Mario Brothers. So, this has been Miles Luigi.